What's going on, everybody? Welcome to Twitch in the Spook TV. I'm Tony. Um, today, I'm going to be doing a video on the Fish Vault Elite Box, an unboxing video. Um, before we get started, if you like the videos, like the content, do me a favor, hit the subscribe button, hit the like button on the video. That way, more people see the video. Hopefully, we get more people join on board watching the shows, things like that. So, appreciate it. And, uh, I don't know, I'm going to get into uh, unboxing this uh, Fish Vault. Like I said, it's uh, Fish Vault Elite is what this is. Uh, it's a monthly subscription service. Uh, I believe they started with a hunting-based box, and then they got into doing the Fish Vault. Uh, I am only trying it out for a month. I decided to try this one out uh, specifically because it included the Garmin Striker 4 Fish Finder, which I'm going to put on my kayak. So I was looking forward to that and figured, well, we'll get some other stuff while I'm at it and try this out. Also, look at the box. It says it is family and veteran owned. Myself being a veteran, I do appreciate that. So to all you other veterans out there, thank you for your service, by the way. do appreciate it. So let's get into it. Let's see what we got here. I'm excited. I've been waiting for this box. I've been waiting. Tracking it, looking for it, wondering where it is. There it goes. All right, let's get into this. All right, very nicely packaged here. You see, fish vault box. You see, it's got the fish vault flag logo on the top here. Wrapped in some nice paper here. Nice presentation. Well, see. Get a little card you do get a card with it and this card lets you know um what's in the box and uh you know what it might be worth and you know things like that so we'll start out right off the top of the list we got the garmin 4 striker the garmin striker 4 fish finder that bad boy right there now that i'm excited about like as i said that's going on my kayak. I just put a new stadium seat on it. Now I'm going to put this on. I am stoked. Uh, I'll be able to get some good information when I'm out fishing. It's going to be very helpful. So there you go. Garmin Striker 4 Fish Finder. First item in the box. That's why I ordered it. It's number two. Fuzi XP3 Realtree Mako. Say what now? Never worry about your phone overheating in the heat or the sun, worse yet, sinking to the bottom of the river. With multiple attachment points and an internal stash pocket for your hunting license, credit cards, and cash, you don't have to carry a bulky wallet or a thick plastic hard case on your phone and wonder where to put it all. So, that's this right here. The Fuzi Multipoint Attachment System. XP3 series. Now, if I'm not mistaken, this is some sort of a pouch. Oh, wait. Are these just the straps? Ah. Okay, I got you. So here we go. So these are the straps. Okay. Uh, the three strap. I kind of jumped the line. This was sitting on top. I apologize. So what I just read, the Mako, that is this right here. Um... It's thermal drop and float protection for your smartphone. Now, how awesome is that? I got a fish finder for my kayak, and I got this sweet case for my phone with these three straps, okay? So those are attachment points, so you can use those along with the, um, along with this thermal capsule. It's in a real tree fishing pattern. That's cool. Uh, it fits a variety of other large size phones, uh, military grade drop protection, uh, flotation protection, uh, preserves battery life, cold proof and heat proof. So you see, it's like a, it's like a pouch. Okay. You can put your phone in there. Um, and then you have the different attachment points, a loop, um, things like that. You can attach it wherever. Um, that's going to be real handy out on my kayak as well. So I look forward to that. Put that right with the Garmin. What else we got in here? All right, so I jump a line. Let's see what it was. Cold Steel Kudu Light Knife. 
It resembles a classic Kudu ring lock knife in every aspect, except it relies on a heavy spring to keep it, the blade open, like classic slip joint pocket knives. There you go. The Cold Steel. Cold Steel is the company. Four and a quarter inch blade. It's called the Kudo Light. Okay. It's your standard, uh, what is it? Oh, I'm sorry. I forgot to tell you about values on these. So the uh, Fuzi, the um, cell phone case, that was valued. The Garmin was valued at $120. Uh, the Fuzi, uh, $50. Uh, and the straps to go with the phone case, those are valued at nine. So we're already up to what I spent. This box runs for the Elite Service, $160 a month. You get a, I think you get a little price cut. If you do a month or a year long subscription and you get entered in giveaways and, um, you know, you get some other things like that. Um, so, you know, if, if you got the money I mean, it could be worth it. Like I said, I did this specifically for the finder because I knew it was in there and I knew it was going to be a good price for it. Go along with the other stuff in here. So I figured go for it. So now the cold steel kudu knife that's valued at $9 as well. Let's crack it open. See what we're looking at here. Oh, nice, it came right on. Oh, here we go. Here's your kudu. Oh, yeah, that's it's got a real strong spring on it. That spring is really strong. Um, light feel, real light, real light knife. Um, actually, a plastic handle. I am not 100% crazy about that. And it does have a bit of a... I don't know what the metal on the back is. I guess that's just decoration. And I believe it just, yep, yeah, it's just a strong spring fold knife. So there you have it. Cold steel. Kudu knife. As I said, plastic handle. Not crazy about that, but, well, you know, being a guy, you can never have too many knives. Am I right? So that can be an extra sort of tackle bag or something along those lines. We'll see you see. What's next on the list? Duke. Canon Bloody Knuckles Travel Size. It is a hand repair bomb. Here, Duke Canon Bloody Knuckles Hand Repair Bomb. Made with lanolin. Fragrance free. Alright, so that's good for fishing. I have like fruity smells on your hands. You can smell like raspberries or lavender or something like that. Bloody Knuckles got the little boxing guy on the side there, Bloody Knuckles. Pretty funny. Open it up here, see what we're looking at. Of course, it's got a safety seal on it. Everything has a safety seal these days, right? Yes. All right. Well, take my word for it. I'm not going to peel it off right now, but there you go. Made in the USA. So, some cream to keep. Maybe, uh, you know, I don't know. Might be worth keeping in the tackle bag, you know, the dry hands or something. Might be good. Uh... Formulated to repair the hands of workers, fighters, and world champions. Well, there you go. If it's good enough for them, it's good enough for us. So, I'll give it a shot. And let's see, last but not least, Peak Refuel Mountain Berry Granola. Uh, the Bloody Knuckles hand bomb was valued at $8. And the Peak Refuel Mountain Berry Granola, this is valued at $8 as well. There you go right there. Um, this is granola and rice milk with strawberries, blueberries, and raspberries. 13 grams of protein per pouch. So there you go. Protein packed little snack if you need it. Um, something nice to keep maybe in my stash in my kayak, you know, for some energy. Um, I'll, you know. I also have some military MREs. Uh, those are handy for the uh, kayak as well. My, thankfully, my brother-in-law helped me out with some of those. So I'm going to put those to use. But this right here, not really bad. Um, two servings. Just add water. Looks pretty simple. Uh, you just open the pouch. Uh, you add a cup of water. Zip it. Shake it. Open it up and eat it. You don't get much easier than that. So there you go. Crunchy granola. 13 grams of protein per pouch. So back on the water in no time am i right all right well there you go that's uh that's the fish fall elite box for the month of april 2021 featuring 
the Garmin Striker 4 Fish Finder right there. Cannot wait to get a battery hooked up to that bad boy and get out on the water and try it out. Hey, y'all, thanks for watching the show. I appreciate it. And uh, as I said, hit that subscribe button, hit the like button, and I'll be back at you soon. Thanks for tuning in. <clears throat>